In the scriptures, there are very few sacred instances in which the voice of God the Father has been heard. So when he says something, we really need to listen. Repeatedly, he has personally introduced his beloved son, Jesus Christ, with a specific charge to hear him. Have you ever stopped to ask why? Why is our Heavenly Father so insistent and consistent in his plea that we should hear his beloved Son, Jesus Christ? Jesus answered this question himself. He said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. No man cometh unto the Father but by me. Our Father loves us and yearns for each one of us to choose to return to His holy presence. He pleads with us to listen to the voice of Jesus Christ, whom the Father anointed and appointed as our mediator, savior, and redeemer. In this special year, as we commemorate the 200th anniversary of the first vision, I invite you to think deeply and often about this key question. How do you hear him? I also invite you to take steps to hear him better and more often. Throughout this year, we will focus in a special way on this historic event that took place in the Sacred Grove. I invite you to be proactive and look for opportunities to share your feelings about the Lord Jesus Christ with your family and friends including inviting your friends to join you in worshiping Him on Easter Sunday. Now, as one of the Lord's special witnesses, I bless you in your efforts to get on and stay on His covenant path and strive with all your heart, might, mind, and soul to hear Him.